So you had an entrepreneurial idea. You pitched it to senior management. You got approval. You executed the project. Touchdown. Big win for yourself and your company. Now here is where people make a fundamental mistake. Successfully executing an entrepreneurial project is a remarkable accomplishment. It is not just about achievement, it's about leveraging this success as a springboard for your career growth. Now, I will share with you the things that you can do to ensure that you maximize the impact of successfully executing an entrepreneurial project. I'll start from what I think is the least important, graduate at the hand of what I think of high importance to you. If this is something that's interesting to you, let's go. Firstly, celebrate collaboratively. And in that there is team gratitude, right? So organize a small event, a virtual get together to appreciate everyone's efforts. Your magnanimity in sharing in the limelight underscores your leadership. And in celebrating collaboratively, you also have to highlight key players. Now feature key team players that have significantly contributed to the project, including yourself. Especially to women leaders, there is a place for we did a good job and there is also a place for saying I did a good job. The next thing to do is to document and showcase. Now. In documenting and showcasing, you have to craft a compelling narrative. Look, create a detailed report or a case study capturing the innovation journey, the ideation, the challenges faced, the strategies adopted, the eventual outcomes. And in the process of documenting and showcasing, you have to show metrics and impact. So design engaging visuals or infographics, um, that tell the story about the numbers, emphasizing the value that was brought to your organization. The next thing is engaging leadership, specifically senior leadership. So please, please, please find a way to be able to debrief executives on the project success, ensuring that they recognize the value of the entrepreneurial endeavors and your role in it. Also in engaging senior leadership, gather testimonials. It will be amazing if you can get the endorsement of high level executives. Getting an endorsement from a high level executives can be a significant boost, lending credibility to your career going forward. The next thing to do is to broadcast on corporate platforms. I know some people cringe about putting themselves out there. But you've done the work. Why not show everybody that you did a good job? Make sure you can share on internal corporate digital channels. So discuss the innovation project's journey and the success on your internal platforms. And that even helps foster a culture of innovation within your organization. Also in broadcasting internally, participate in knowledge sharing. So offer insights through company webinars and forums ensuring that your expertise becomes a valuable organization asset. Next, see speaking opportunities. You can do that firstly through internal knowledge exchanges. So you can propose a workshop uh, centered around innovation methodology within your organization. You can teach other departments how to leverage on innovation within the organization. Position yourself as the innovation champion. And in seizing speaking opportunities, do external advocacy. So offer yourself up to go and tell the story of the innovation of the company in external conferences, both positioning yourself and your company as innovators. Next, leverage learning. In leveraging learning, do feedback cultivation. Have a feedback loop so that you can take the learnings and apply them to other innovation projects. The other thing around leveraging learning is skills or augmentation. So based on your project learning, identify the areas for personal development, based strategy, technology, whatever it is, and then push to get training in those areas. Now that you've had success, this is the best time to pitch new innovations to senior management. 
leverage on your success to recommend further innovations use the credibility that you've gained from that success to propose your next success also under that offer to mentor aspiring entrepreneurs and innovators within your organization share your experiences with guidance and solidify your status as an innovation leader then i think one of the most important things is to connect beyond the walls of your company moving yourself as, as not just an innovator within your company but an innovator within your industry network engage with corporate innovators at industry events build out your network with like-minded professionals also Forge ties with innovation thought leaders. Um, engaging in discussions with established innovators can provide fresh insights and even potential collaborations. Finally, 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 sometimes there is a gap between the one success and the next success. Remember to stay on senior management's radar by using periodic impact updates so keep leadership and stakeholders informed about lasting benefits and potential expansions for your innovation and underneath that do active engagement regularly contribute to cross-functional team discussions on strategy ensuring that your innovation spread remains in the spotlight in conclusion the execution of a successful corporate innovation project isn't the end but a beautiful beginning by strategically broadcasting engaging and building upon your success you're not only elevating your professional status but you're also setting the stage for future entrepreneurial endeavors celebrate share and let your innovation story inspire others while cementing your position as an indispensable asset to your organization Listen, I hope this was useful in your journey and thank you for listening.